Conviction and focus. You gossip and gamble. Tasks set to you are left unfulfilled or poorly performed. This ends today. I will not suffer further degradation at his hands. For whether or not you see it, and you should, this is your fault. You've brought shame upon us all. Skill and dedication are what won us up, and they will be required to keep it. I have been too lenient, it seems. But no more. You will train harder and more often. If this means missing meals, missing sleep, so be it. Should you learn your tasks, you will learn the true meaning of discipline. Bring them forward. If I must make examples of some of you to ensure obedience, so be it. The two of you stand accused of pouring and drinking while on duty. What say you to these charges? My, my, my lord, please. We, we, we meant no harm. We, we forgot ourselves. It will not happen again. No, it won't. <laughs> this regard for duty is infectious. It shall be rooted out and destroyed. In this way, we may prevent its spread. Am I understood? Yes, my lord. Of course, by your command. Good, good. Return to your posts filled with a new sense of purpose. Stay strong, stay focused, and we will triumph. Falter, however, and you will join these men. Be sure of it. Dismissed! are at an end. What do you know of my work? I know that you are going to murder Richard and claim Akka for your son Conrad. <laughs> for Conrad? My son is an arse, unfit to lead his host, let alone a kingdom. And Richard, the Oncino is no better, blinded as he is by faith in the insubstantial. Akka does not belong to either of them. Then who? The city belongs to its people. How can you claim to speak for the citizens? You stole their food, disciplined them without mercy, forced them into service under you. Everything I did, I did to prepare them for the new world. Stole their food? No. I took possession so that when the lean times came, it might be rationed properly. <coughs> Look around. My district is without crime, save those committed by you and your ilk. And as for the conscription, they were not being trained to fight. They were being taught the merits of order and discipline. These things are hardly evil. No matter how noble you believe your intentions, these acts are cruel and cannot continue. <laughs> we'll see how sweet they are, the fruits of your labors. You do not free the cities as you believe, but rather damn them. And in the end, you'll have only yourself to blame. You who speak of good intentions.